Hi everyone, welcome to A Godly Home. We're going to be taking a look at Dollar General today as part of my series, Why I Shop at Multiple Stores. If you guys have been waiting for this video, I apologize that it's taken so long. Um, I had some other videos that were pressing that had to be done first. So one of the things that I notice about Dollar General is that they're really good about showing you right in the sale flyer what items match up with their digital coupons. Now, if you're going to be shopping at Dollar General, make sure you sign up for their digital coupon program and make sure that you clip those digitally before you go to the store. When you get to the store, when you're ready to check out, you'll just put your telephone number in and then you'll pay and your coupons will automatically come off. Now, I am not an expert on Dollar General. If any of you are, leave us some comments below. I don't get to this store very often because it's like 10 miles in the opposite direction from where I would normally be going. But I do think that it is a good store to shop at if it's close to you or if you're going by. So I thought we'd take a look at it. So I am not sure on soda. I don't buy soda, but that may be a good deal. The two for five on Lay's chips is a good deal. Um, the General Mills cereal, two for five, and then you clip that digital coupon and you're getting it two for four. That's a good deal. Uh, two for seven on the post and there's a coupon for that too, which will bring that down some more. Um, the all and snuggle laundry detergents products here. Um, four fifty plus a dollar digital coupon that makes it three fifty. You cannot beat these sale prices when you add a digital coupon to them. Same with the gain. Then we have these cleaners: buy two get one free. More soda and chip deals. A uh, digital coupon, save $1 when you spend $5 on any of the brands shown here. That's a good stock up deal. I will do deals like that sometimes and just put the stuff away and have it on hand. Okay, we have a similar deal over here with the dryer sheets and stuff. Now, um... I don't use many paper towels. I'm not sure on that. Now, when I see a dish soap deal like this, a Dawn dish soap, it seems like every flyer is offering a different size. So I actually end up doing the math on that and figuring out the price per ounce in order to compare it to other stores. And the Kellogg cereals on sale, two for seven. And these are family size boxes, so that's pretty good. Granola bars, three for seven. And I think there's a 50 off, 50 cent off two coupon to go with that. This is good. I like how they do this, where they show you if you switch just your brands, how much you can save. And that's a good reminder whether you're shopping at Dollar General or somewhere else. It's a good time right now to be experimenting with other brands. I know we experimented on our mayonnaise and switched to store brand. And we didn't notice any difference, but the cost was unbelievably different. I don't buy enough trash bags to know if any of that's a good deal. Once again, their dollar deals, you cannot beat their dollar deals. A lot of their dollar deals are the same items as Dollar Tree. So you're saving 25 cents per item by getting them there. 
I find in the summertime having some different drink mixes on hand can save a lot of money when you're out and about all the time because you can just take a minute and fill a to-go bottle and it's cold and refreshing and you're not tempted to stop at a convenience store for a cold drink. Good deal on crackers. They have the Hershey bars on sale, the graham crackers on sale, and there's a deal with this on the digital coupons we'll take a look at in a minute. The summer toys for kids, a dollar once again. That's going to be cheaper than Dollar Tree. Uh, I don't know if this is a good deal on these pools or not, but for $9, that would make a pretty good little raised garden bed if you didn't have anything else to grow in. Same with all this decorative garden stuff. That's going to be a little bit cheaper than uh, Dollar Tree. Three for ten on Gildan t-shirts. That's a good deal. These chairs for ten dollars. I bought one of these many years ago and I didn't really expect it to last all that long and I'm pretty heavy, you know, so I thought this is just not going to last. And I'm still using it. I have it in the camper. I love it. It worked out great. I keep one of these coolers with me most of the summer for grocery shopping. Um, I'll put my milk and cheese and everything in there and uh, have some ice packs in there so that when I get home, you know, I have a drive home in the heat and then I might be a little bit when I get home before I can get stuff taken care of. That way I know everything stays cold. These solar lights, same deal. That's going to be a better deal than Dollar Tree right now. Bug spray. Oh, wow. We go through so much bug spray in the state of Maine. It's nuts. We would just be eaten alive without it. In fact, I keep some in the bathroom and I put it on in the morning when I get ready so that I can go about my day without being chewed alive. All kinds of pet food deals. More laundry detergent deals. On the laundry detergent, guys, I find I can get really good deals if I watch the sale flyers on the smaller bottles, and that's comparable to the large bottle bottle deals. And I prefer that because I find they're lighter weight for me to handle, and I don't have a tendency to pour out as much. Seems to work out pretty good for me. Uh, bounce and different fabric softeners and stuff like that. There's a deal on that. Makeup deals, shampoos, medicines, Colgate toothpaste deal, save an additional dollar, regular $2.75 to $4. Says it's a two count. Oh, the toothbrush is a two count, okay. Now, these loves diapers make me laugh. Obviously, I don't have any need to be buying diapers, but um, back when my son was a baby, I used the loves brand, and I actually found that it worked better than like Pampers or Huggies or any of those high-end brands. But there was never any coupons for them, and it was like I would have loved to have had a $2 off coupon back then. If you're a mom and you haven't tried the Love's diapers, I assume that they're as good as they were like 19 years ago. But you might want to check that deal out. Consider switching brands if you're paying a lot right now. Okay, let's take a look at our coupons.
Now, I think normally they offer a $5 coupon if you're shopping on Saturday. It's like $5 off if you spend $20 or $25. I can't remember which, but I don't have that coupon this week. So I don't know if they've stopped doing that or what's going on there. If you guys know, leave me a comment. Okay, I only use Scott toilet paper, so of course if I needed toilet paper and I was going there, I would clip that. There's our dollar off two Big G cereals. Here's that dollar off all. Fifty cents on the Dawn, fifty cents on Hellman's mayonnaise. If you're still using Hellman's mayonnaise, any deal you can get on that will help. That is so crazy expensive. And here's that fifty cents on two granola bars. Oh, when you buy two Folgers coffees, save a dollar, and they have that eighteen hundred Folgers as part of that deal. There's all kinds of coupons here that can help people out. I love digital coupons versus paper ones. It's just so slick and so easy. Now, I will say, though, I have seen a lot of stuff on uh, YouTube and things where these extreme couponers go into Dollar General and end up being escorted out by the police. If you guys are thinking about extreme couponing or following some extreme coupon people on YouTube and copying what they do, I'm going to give you a warning. I would not be doing that at Dollar General. They don't seem to have much tolerance for it. It is not the place. Same with those penny deals that people get there. That seems to really set them off. But, um, you know, they offer good sales. And when you combine it with the digital coupons, there's no need to do that anyways. Okay, a dollar off the post cereal. When you buy two, there's a coupon for that. I mean, they have so many cereal deals this week. You basically can go with whatever brand you like best. Pillsbury Soft Bake, save a dollar on two. I picked up a package of these cookies into Walmart this weekend. My kitchen was torn apart for some renovating. And I wasn't going to be able to bake cookies. And I thought, oh, I'll grab a package of those soft-baked Pillsbury. I've never had them before. And I had and I bought a deal for them. I got the peanut butter ones with a chocolate drizzle. Well, I'm going to warn you guys right now, they are good, but I ate the entire package in two days alone. I will not be buying them again because I obviously can't handle it. There's that dollar off toothpaste to go with that deal. And here's a additional uh, digital coupon save do uh, $5 on any gain purchase of $30 or more. So that's a really good stock up deal. And here's the dollar coupon when you spend five on the cookies and crackers. Okay, here is that deal to go with those graham crackers and Hershey bars being on sale. So how this deal works is you clip this coupon, you buy one box of graham crackers, one package of the Hershey bars, and you get the marshmallows free. 
which is a really good deal considering it's that time of year where people are camping and things and wanting to make s'mores. There's that diaper coupon. Okay, guys, that is all I have to say about Dollar General. I probably missed a lot. If you are a Dollar General shopper, please let us know what I missed. And I hope everybody had a great day. And I have some more videos coming up this week on various topics. So I'll see you then. Bye.